I'm Colin Davis with your WCYT News Update. In international news, multiple people were killed in a Quebec City mosque during evening prayers. Witnesses of the shooting say as many as three gunmen opened fire at the Quebec City Islamic Cultural Center, which reported about 100 people inside. In response to the cowardly act, Quebec Premier Philippe Couard condemned the attacks, saying Quebec categorically rejects this barbaric violence. In the past few days, several world leaders have reacted to President Trump's executive order banning citizens from seven Muslim-majority countries from entering the United States. The order was signed last Friday and bars citizens from Syria, Iraq, Iran, Yemen, Libya, Somalia, and Sudan from entering the country for 90 days. Some officials have criticized the ban, such as British Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson, who described the decision as divisive and wrong. Others show support for the executive order, such as Australian Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull, who said it is vital that every nation is able to control who comes across its borders. Right here in Indiana, state legislators have given a Senate committee the go-ahead to hear a testimony on a medical marijuana-related bill. This bill, while still in very early stages, would legalize the use of hemp oil to treat epilepsy in children, giving a glimmer of hope to supporters of the legalization of medical marijuana. I'm Colin Davis and this has been your WCYT News Update.